Hello, welcome to another great and exciting DBS session with yours truly, Alvin and Savior here. If today is your first time, you are warmly welcome, but we'd like you to also check out our previous videos on the John chapter 15 series. Today, we consider verses 11 to 17 of John chapter 15. Please pause the video, get a notebook and a pen, and let's get into God's Word. As I read from my Bible, you may read along. I have told you these things so that you will be filled with my joy. Yes, your joy will overflow. This is my commandment. Love each other in the same way I have loved you. There is no greater love than to lay down one's life for one's friends. You are my friends if you do what I command. I no longer call you slaves because a master doesn't confide in slaves. Now you are my friends. Since I've told you everything the Father told me, you didn't choose me. I chose you. I appointed you to go and produce lasting fruits so that the Father will give you whatever you ask for, using my name. This is my command. Love each other. Now it's time to retell the story in our own words. Now give it a go. Jesus told these words to them so that his joy will be in them and that their joy will overflow. Jesus commands us to love each other as he loves us. When we do what Jesus commands, we become his friends. Jesus has also chosen and appointed his disciples to go and bear fruits that will last, so that whatever they ask the Father in his name, they will receive. Amazing! As Alvin continues to lead the session, you can pause the video for a second. Go over the passage again. You may want to close your Bible and try to say the passage in your own words. You may also want to speak it out loud or write it down. And if you find you are struggling to remember it, please read it again. Now, you may join us to discover the story together. Great! And we ask four applicable questions here. The first, what do you learn about God from this story? For me, God has commanded us to love one another as he loves us. And God has chosen and appointed us to bear fruits that remain. God answers us when we ask in Jesus' name. Please pause the video, go back to the passage if you have to, and answer this question based on your discovery. We ask the second question now. What do you learn about people from the story? We would like to begin with you. Please pause the video as you answer the question. For me, Jesus chooses people and appoints them to go and produce lasting fruit. I see from the story that if we do what Jesus says, we become his friends. We must love each other. Now it's time to ask the third question. How are you going to apply this story to your life? For myself, I'll do what Jesus says so I become his friend. And I will ask God in the name of Jesus to help me love people just like Jesus loves me. Please pause the video, reflect on the passage, see how it applies to your life, and write down your I will statement. We ask the final question now. Who are you going to share this story with? I'll share it with a friend called Redemption. And I will go through my WhatsApp contact list today and share it with people. Now who comes to mind for you to share this story with? Thank you so much for joining us today. It's always a pleasure coming your way and joining you to study God's way. If you are doing this with a friend or a family, share what you are thankful for and what your challenges are and pray for one another. God's grace and peace.